Hello and welcome to episode 2 of Surface, the noise she couldn't make. Um, and I can't even remember what I have to do. Um, yes. Right. Uh, alrighty. May as well use the hint because yeah, I wasn't really sure what to do there. I have no idea what I'm doing here. Let's have a look at the info. That they'll show the con oh the constellations on the left, okay. Um so the eye I suppose. What the Or anyway, I can. I'm really, really bad at anything kind of um, visual like this. I'm really horrible at like seeing um, visual illusions or anything like that. So this might take a while. Mm. For oh, fuck's sake! <laughs> I'm so shit at this stuff. Um, yeah, let's reset it. Hmm. Where is it? If we can find like a little circle in the middle. Um Oh yeah alright <laughs> I definitely meant to do that. Oh I can kinda see this one. Uh, yay Oh yeah see why well, was I haven't so much trouble with the first one. Let's go. Jane! Oh no! Uh, whoa, whoa. That's nice! Mm. Oh no, I need to, yeah. Let's just... Oh, <laughs> oh dear, stop. Please. What buttons? Okay, well, I found the belt. Oh, hat. Thank you. And a star. How lovely. The night. Hello, night. Mm, a tool. A tool, you say. Scalpel. Oh, for fuck's sake. Plastic cake and sorrowful little flower. 
told the psychic one thing. The girl desperately wanted a protector, a loyal companion. For any other girl, such dreams would seem natural. But here, in Jane Doe, it's beyond a dream. It's a dying hope. Why is this dollhouse separate from the rest of town? Why is she trying to get away from it? Yes, why is she drained? Ooh, a gripping tool. Hey, well. Let's go. Maybe we can be her protector. Um, gripping tool. Yay. Mailbox flag. I remember a mailbox somewhere. Just trying to think where. Back at this house? Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Oh, thanks for the package, Jane. Couldn't have just given it to me anyway, you fucking asshole. If we're trying to help Jane, why is she, you know... Although, maybe that's just the only way she can... Communicate. I'm sure she doesn't have an awful lot of power here, or else she wouldn't have been, you know, continually dragged away. Ooh. Spooky. Is there a doctor in the house? Hmm. Mm, this is scary. Hello? Oh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah. Mm, nice. Mm, I say. Monocle. Mm hmm, hmm, hmm. La -la. Uh, there are labels for each part of the patient's body. Okay. Hmm? Yeah, okay. Um, right. Ah! Fuck's sake, Snake. <laughs> I like him. Hello. Hello, this is... No, no. Alright. Oh, wonderful. Um, I think that's uh, like a Ruka chess piece. Yeah. Um, one thing I really like about this, actually, um, I don't know, it's pointless as an object, but still are finding the objects, at least in this. You know, when you find the right object, that's it. Which is good, instead of, you know, fucking having to find a million different stupid objects that you're never going to use. Like, once you find the object you're looking for, there you go. Which is good. Um, I need bulb. Maybe Snakey wants to have some of this. Monocle? Star? Hat? Belt? This thing? Wheel? Looks like Snake. Right, well, what are we going to do now? Uh, hint! Okay. Ooh, that's not it. Nice. <sighs> Good sneaky, eat that mouse. Right. There we go. Okay, well, let's have a quick look at our... Hmm, fever is gone. Um, 
Wreck ship done done done. Wreck ships hold. Ambulance carriage is where we are. Tower gate. Right. So maybe the wreck ships hold. Let's have a look back there. It's been a while. Oh yeah. Oh okay, yeah, here we go. Uh oh, look, nice. Um no, where did we Ah, where did we need this for? <sighs> um Can you remember? Uh, up here maybe? There we go. Excellent day. Into the stables. Right, well, yep, yeah, I have another belt. There we go. Okay. Quick, good. Oh great. All right, well, uh, we found that thing, whatever that is, a uh, horseshoe. Okay. The psychic found an empty dog's kennel Doggy! and a collar. The poor girl had lost what might have been her only friend, but she's haunted by something else. The loss of the dog was only the last straw that broke her. Jesus Christ, it's quite depressing. Um, move, I take a picture. <laughs> so I need to go and get the camera and take a picture of the bone. Okay, um, right, well. I didn't even know so. <laughs> anyway. There. I presume that's for um No. Uh look the map. Still haven't found everything here, okay. That's um, a hint. Okay. Oh, I didn't even say that. Ah, uh, look. We'll leave Clover. Yeah, go Ireland. Um. Okay, well. Hint? No, it's too early for a hint.
Okay. Okay, now we're starting to get moving a bit. Okay, now I'm stuck again. Yay. Uh. Oh, okay. Right, um... That's the curry of crystal ball. Hmm. How long is a fucking moment? Um. Yeah, obviously, yeah. Actually, would have been pretty obvious if I had, you know, looked properly instead of being an idiot. Um, yay! Oh, 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 what a lovely joke! Right, jigsaw. I haven't done one of these in a while.
Yay. Defibrillator. Yeah, a defibrillator even. Oh, lovely. Uh, so to. Hint. Who wouldn't? <laughs> I don't like the way these hints make you sound like a dumbass. Throne room, holy fuck. Jane. You fucking asshole, I'm gonna... The psychic held another page of the girl's memory. Handwriting had changed. The page altered. It was disquieting. Taking over this weak girl was easy. She's a coward. She can't finish anything she starts, and she lacks the courage to save herself. She's just going to have to suffer. She deserves it. The psychic is shocked by the realization that the girl's personality has split. That's why she lost control of her body. But how did a personality as aggressive as noises appear? Only a severe psychological trauma could cause such a thing. You're going down, noise. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Why is she your alter ego? We'll have to find out. I don't remember seeing a plunger anywhere else. Okay. Fire roar. Uh. Meow. Plunger. Alright, let's go and get Jane. I'm coming, Jane. I'm coming to save you. Jane! Jane! Yeah. She's gone into respiratory arrest. She's weakening. She can't breathe. Poor girl. Oh shit, it's noise! You fucking slut. Yeah, you're starting there, I'll fucking knock you out. You're going down, bitch. Okay, maybe, uh. Maybe I'm going down instead. It stopped. We can't lose her now. Please do something. The psychic, falling deeper into the poor girl's tortured mind, kept thinking about what might be the blocking force inside her. If it's too dark, the girl is doomed. has returned to normal, but the machine is still breathing for her. This is her last chance. Thank you for staying with her. Good luck. Okay, so 
we've moved from the fever to the mis to respiratory problems and we're continuing to delve deeper into Jane Doe's mind so that's where I'm going to leave for episode 2 uh, I hope you enjoy it and tune in next time to see what happens <laughs>